Up Next, which can be viewed by clicking on this button up in the toolbar, is basically a live playlist that you can add or remove songs to and adjust their playback order on the fly. If I click the play button on an album, it'll start playing from its first song. And then click the Up Next button. The songs in that album are lined up and will play in this order. You can prevent a song from being played by clicking the X button here to remove it. We can also adjust the order of playback by drag and drop. At the top of the Up Next list is a History tab. Click this to view the previously played songs with the one played most recently all the way at the top. While in this list we can click the triple dots button next to each song and play the song next. So it's going to jump to the top of the Up Next list. Notice now that we kind of have two lists all of a sudden. And the Up Next button is blue. This means Up Next is now active. So right now, after the current song ends, Home is a Fire will play. And then the songs in the Narrow Stairs album will continue. If I add a song to Up Next, which can also be done from the history list, it's going to be added after Home is a Fire. Click on the clear button and the up next list is erased. When the song currently playing is over, iTunes will stop playing. I'm going to start this album up again and then add a second album to up next. To do so, I'm just going to drag and drop it up to the up next button. So now I have these two albums lined up. Notice now that the Up Next button is turned blue. This means that the Up Next playlist is active, and if I were to double click on a different song to play it, iTunes will warn me that I have songs set to playback in Up Next. So do I really want to play this song? We get a couple options here. First I could just cancel and continue with what's playing in Up Next. Click Play Song and the song will begin, but the Up Next list is unaffected. After this song ends, those in the Up Next list will continue playing. If I click Clear Songs, the Up Next list will be emptied and this song will play. Once it's over, iTunes will proceed playing the songs in the album that it's part of. But notice that Up Next is no longer active, so if I click on a different song, I don't get the same message. You can add playlists to Up Next as well. Just drag them up to the Up Next button. So when working with Up Next, click and drag a song, album, or playlist to the Up Next button to play it after the current songs that are in Up Next. If you want to play something right after the current song is over, Choose Play Next by right-clicking or using the triple dots button. To play a new song immediately, double-click on it. Then decide if you want to clear the Up Next list or play this song and continue with the Up Next list after it's over. 